The Army Corps of Engineers rules are very specific. They break these up into projects. That is the Northern Ocean County project. You cannot break, because what will happen is if you build a dune in Ortley and you have less of one, let's say at Normandy Beach and then further up into Maniloking, what will happen is the water will be driven that way and will cause even bigger problems further up or down the beach, depending upon where you put it. it from an engineering perspective, it has to be all done in major sections, like Long Beach Island's being done in a major section. Southern, uh, Southern New Jersey, Cape May County was done in a major section. So you can't just work on it. Now what we did was we put more sand in there. DEP went in at the state expense and put more sand in there to try to stop and I think it contributed to stopping the flooding in Ortley being even worse. But if you look at what happened in Ortley, that's why we have to get this dune project done. And if you look at what happened down on the ocean side in Avalon, in Stone Harbor, um, where we have the engineered beaches, you had no problem with flooding on the ocean side. The problem you had was back bay flooding, but not ocean flooding. So that's why I continue to harp on this, is because it works. It works, and we've seen it work over and over again. And you saw Ortley that desperately needs it. And those people are at risk because folks in Bayhead and Point Pleasant Beach want their view and continue to insist ridiculously that somehow me or whoever the next governor is, is going to want to build like public bathrooms and hot dog stands on their strip of sand that we're taking to build these dunes. I've said it over and over again. We got plenty to do in state government. I don't need to run public bathrooms and hot dog stands. Um, in, in Bayhead or Point Pleasant Beach. They got plenty to eat there and they have plenty of bathrooms. I'm not worried about it. What I want to prevent is massive flooding like we saw after Sandy. I mean, do people forget what it looked like in Maniloking when we had a new inlet? I mean, that's the kind of thing we're looking at. But you look at what happened in Maniloking this time because we had the, the sheeting project in Maniloking. You didn't see any of the problems that you saw in Ortley. Let us do the work. But yet you have these lawyers and their clients who continue to fight this. So we're going to have to continue to go and fight in court. But you can't have been in Ortley Beach like I was on Saturday and see that and not know how important this is. And that's why I was saying the things that I was saying. And I'll continue to say it. And I know the people in Margate don't like it. And I know the people in Point Pleasant Beach and the people in, in uh, Bayhead don't like it. But I, I have the whole state to worry about. And by the way, the people inland in Bayhead and Point Pleasant Beach and Ortley, man, they wish it got done because that water's not just going to stop at the beach front houses. It's going to go in as we saw it happen in Sandy in a really bad storm.